Hello friends, welcome to this new Java programming tutorial. Today we will discuss how to calculate average of numbers entered by a user on console. So friends, let's implement how to calculate average of numbers entered by a user on the console. So first we will create a scanner object. In order to use scanner we have to first import it. Now what this line actually does, it creates a it creates a scanner which can read from the console. Here system dot in points to our console. So let's move ahead and create few variables. Here we have created three variables by the name sum, average and count. Sum variable will hold the sum of the numbers entered by the user. Average variable will hold average of the numbers. And count variable will hold count of the number entered by the user. So let's move ahead. We'll prompt the user to enter a few numbers. So this line will prompt the user to enter the numbers. Then we'll create a while loop. And the condition for the loop will be scanner.hasNext. So what is scanner method has next does? This method return true whenever there is values available to read from the console. So it returns so it returns true if there is any value available to be read from console and this while loop will loop till it finds any value in the console. So let's move ahead. We create a if condition if we create a if condition that scanner dot has next double. Now what has next double does? It returns returns true Now what this has next double method does? It returns true if there is any double value available to be read from console. So we will first put a check that whether the user has entered any double value or not. So if the value is double what we'll do, we'll take sum equals sum plus we have taken sum equals sum plus scanner dot next double. It will read the double value entered by the user and it will add it to sum and assign it back to the sum. Let's move ahead and we will do we'll do count plus plus because e so each time user enter a double value, we have to increment the count here and we have to take that double value and add it to the previous sum and to the sum. Now let's move ahead. Else, else if, if the user has not entered a double value, then we will create a string object. So what we are implementing here in the else part that if user enters say few variables double and then he wants to take the average of the number he will enter exit. So, so till the time he enters double value this if will be getting executed as soon as he enters something else than double then we will take the, that next value through scanner.next into the exit variable string exit variable 
and we will check that whether he has entered the ex exit or not. If he has entered the exit, we have to break the fob and come out of it. And we will do the average based on that the sum by count will give us the average and we will print the average on the console. But if he has not, hasn't entered the exit, then we will prompt him that program is not exited, you have to enter exit. So let's run this program and see what happens. Let's say we enter few variables and then we want to calculate and suppose we want to calculate the average of these three numbers we will create we will write exit and press enter so here it will print that average of these three numbers is 36.666 and so on so friends let's see what else what part we did to calculate the average of the numbers entered by the user through the console first we created a scanner which could read from the console here then we created three variables sum average and count sum was to hold the sum of the numbers average to hold the average of numbers and count which could hold the count of numbers entered by the user first we prompted the user to enter the numbers and then and the user started entering the numbers so the while loop will loop each and every time the scanner or has next returns true if there is any value available to be read from the console and then we moved ahead we created a if condition that if the user has entered the double double value then take that double value do addition to the previous sum and assign it to some variable only and increment that user has entered one number and then if the user has entered a value other than double then then we move to the else part and else we check that whether he has entered exit or not if he has entered exit there is the break statement which could break the while loop and after breaking a while loop here it calculated average by dividing sum by count and it printed average on the console so friends this was the program to calculate the average of the numbers entered by the user on the console so friends if you like this video then please like us on Facebook and YouTube, share this video on Facebook with your friends and if you have any comments to share then share it below. You can also subscribe my video on YouTube and you can also visit my blog at www.hubberspot.com for more Java tutorials and source code. Thank you very much. Have a nice day. Take care. Bye bye.